Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, definitely hit that subscribe button. So in today's video, we are going to be stuffing our cash envelopes. Yay! So obviously, as you can tell, we only have two bills, and that's only going to fill two envelopes this week. Um, we are currently trying to save for a trip that we are going on soon. Um, and so we want to save about $2,000 for that trip, $1,000 for um, the airplane ride, a rental car, and whatever needs we need for that, those two items. And then on top of that, um, we are going to be saving about $1,000 for spending money and gas money. So I am estimating that we'll probably use about $100 in gas money at that time. Um, it's only a week-long vacation. Um, but that's because we are flying into Massachusetts because that's where my grandparents live and then from Massachusetts We are driving to Cape Cod, which is about a two to three hour drive So that's why I'm estimating that we'll probably be spending a hundred dollars on gas Just to get from point A to point B and then from point B to point C when we drive back that way um, And then any other driving that we do within that time frame so that's just that and then the rest of the money will be spending money which we are so excited this is our first like big family trip that we've been on um, me and Jacob have been together for four and a half years not four and a half years but it'll be four and a half years at that time and we've never gone on like a full-on vacation together um, we've gone to like Orlando which is like two hours away from us and stuff like that but not like into a different state so it's gonna be super fun and this is the first time my daughter is ever going on a trip um, out of state anyways um, she's been to Orlando as well but uh, on a trip with us to Massachusetts and on an airplane like she cannot stop talking about it I, we're just so excited. But anyway, so I did buy the plane ticket today. Um, it cost about $7.51, which was insane for three tickets. But you know, whatever. Um, that's round trip, so there and back. But yeah, so $751 was already spent on this trip. So it's definitely happening. I got the time off approved from work and everything, so I'm just so happy. Um, so yeah, it just takes a lot of stress off of me knowing that everything's already booked and everything. So all I have to do now is worry about the rental car. Um, and I also made sure that we had seats next to each other because I didn't want to have like, um, me and Maddie sitting together and then Jacob sitting somewhere else or Jacob and Maddie sitting together and then me sitting somewhere else or just having Maddie on her own because I know that airplanes would do that if they could. Um, so that's just why I needed to get that out of the way and plus like plane tickets kept going up like I started looking at costs last week and like they went up almost fifty dollars within those seven days five days yeah so definitely wanted to get on it as fast as I could and I also noticed that the flights were being taken up pretty quickly I'm assuming because it's the end of summer vacation so yeah that's just everything we're just gonna dive right in now to um stuff my cash envelopes. I'm sorry for the rambling. I'm just so excited. It's gonna be so fun. Um, but yeah, so the first envelope is household, which currently still has $20 in from last week. So that's gonna make it $40. And cash envelopes, um, I normally just use the household and gas weekly and the rest of them are more like I stuff them once a month and then throughout that month I have that money. Um, but yeah, so this is gas which also gets the other 20. And just to show you how sad my travel envelope is looking, look, it's empty. So I am doing DoorDash, if you guys didn't know, I do like side hustles just to get that extra money in. So tonight I'm doing DoorDash and tomorrow I'm doing DoorDash. So that'll be extra money going straight into the travel envelope as well as I also have an Etsy shop so anything that I make over the next couple weeks from there will first go to like supplies and then whatever is left is going to trickle into the travel. Um, but yeah, so like Christmas I'm not funding until I get my travel envelope where I want it. Same with car maintenance. Spending um, is one of those envelopes that I get a certain amount of monthly and then I just have the whole month to spend it. 
Eating Out is another envelope that I fill monthly and then I have the whole month to spend it. Right now it has $26 but that's actually in my bank account because I needed to make sure that I had enough money to cover travel expenses and all of that for the airplane. And then we have our cat Tinkerbell. Haven't spent any money for her so... Groceries gets um, $40 a month. No, we do not spend $40 a month on groceries though. Um, we have EBT. Um, but yeah, so then the next one is clothing. This is a new sinking fund I recently added. This one will probably get $30 a month, 10 for each of us. Um, but this will be started after travel is done. And then same with house savings, it's on a standstill, it currently has 100 in here, um, and I normally put different amounts every week. So, yeah, this one's just on a standstill for now. So, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, I'm sorry that it wasn't that entertaining, but here we are. <laughs> um, so, I will see you guys later. Bye, everyone.